nothing can stop me. I'm all the way up. Oh. Alright guys, what is going on? It's Jacob here. Today's video is going to be nice and short, nice and concise, straight to the point. I want to give you guys some good practical tips to help with dieting, with meal prep, and really making those bland foods taste a lot better with, you know, next to no calories. So, today's video is going to cover my all-time favorite sauces and condiments for meal prep. Now, these are things that I use on a weekly, if not daily basis, and I recommend to a lot of people. So, I have grouped them into three different groups. Um, the first one being a higher calorie group, but definitely the most tasty. And in that group, I've got these two. So, first one is fountain satay sauce. Now, the fountain range are known to be lower in calories on a, as a whole, uh, but this one's probably not. You get a 20 mil serve, 46 calories, 1.3 grams of protein, 2.3 grams of fat, 5.1 grams of carbs so you know it's not the best and you don't really need too much it's really nice and rich the reason why I get this one is because it reminds me of when I went to Thailand and I actually had traditional you know satay sauce and it was absolutely beautiful really nice and rich and peanutty and this one tastes absolutely amazing it's not sugary like your normal satay sauces the cheap ones and I really like it secondly this one, Nando's pepper sauce. Uh, anything from Nando's except for lemon and herb, I can't handle. So this one is actually extra mild, so it, it suits me well. It's higher in fat. You get a 30 gram serve, which is slightly more than in this one, for 35 calories, no protein, 3.2 grams of fat, and 1.4 grams of carbs. So this is relatively low in carb. If you want to add some fat to your meal, uh, this one would be a good one as well as that, but it's also got some sugar in it. So, as far as taste goes, these are my two favorites at the moment. They're fucking nice. The calories are kind of high, but we've got some other options here that I'm about to show you with much lower calories. So, let's get into those. Now, if you still want a sauce texture, so you don't want like a, a dressing or something really, you know, thin, which is what usually happens when you get low fat stuff, uh, you've got these two. So, the two ranges are Celebrate health, which is weird, and it must support cancer. I don't know. Must do. And this one is the fountain range once again. So this one's a no added sugar barbecue sauce. It really does taste pretty good. Most low sugar sauces you'll find taste kind of weird. Um, this one is sweetened with stevia, and this one's sweetened with natvia. So they are sweetened, so they do taste, you know, pretty much the same as your normal barbecue sauce and tomato sauce. Now, this one has 6 calories per serve in a 15 ml serve. You've got no protein, 1.3 grams of carbs, and no fat. This one is a 20 ml serve, so slightly higher, with, you know, double the calories. You've got 14 calories, but it's still pretty much nothing. No protein, no fat, and 3 grams of carbs. So as far as sticking to a calorie restricted type of diet where you can't go nuts on things, I think that for the volume that you get, I think these two would do you very well. I think that, you know, if you were bulking, you'd probably be more so suited to these ones, but you don't need much. As, as I said, the taste is really nice. So a 20 mil serve of eat, either of these two um, is, is probably enough. These ones, pretty much the same. 15 mil serve, 20 mil serve. Um, I'd have to recommend them, they're fantastic. So. Those are those ones. And in the final sort of group, I have uh, two salad dressings, fat free, and we've got a Worcestershire sauce. So as far as dressings go, um, you know, I, I mix it up as far as brand, flavor, etc. But most salad dressings that you find these days are fat free. It takes out a whole lot of calories. Obviously, these are sort of the consistency is of a vinaigrette sort of thing. So, perfect for salads. You can put it on all types of salads. Next to no calories, you're going to add a whole lot of flavor. And, you, you know, you can't go wrong. I've got balsamic vinaigrette. And I've got a Italian roasted capsicum dressing. Which looks absolutely amazing. I haven't had it yet. Uh, this one, 20 mils. 36 kilojoules, which is... Fuck, I hate doing this. It's like eight, cal eight calories, no protein, no fat, two 
two carbs. This one, 20 mil serve, what do we got? 10 calories, no protein, no fat, two and a half carb. So, you know, 20 mils of either of these in a nice green tossed salad is gonna be more than enough. You're gonna add heaps of flavor, like I said, and I'd have to recommend them. And finally, Worcestershire sauce. Now this one, if you guys know, if you know what's up, you know that you don't need much of this at all. So a teaspoon, which is five mils, gives you eight calories. Two grams of carbs, no protein, no fat. And this is nice on my meats. You're like sauteing mushrooms and onions and garlic and capsicum and things like that in the fry pan. You just pour a bit of that in there. It really gives it a nice, a really nice smoky sort of flavor. You don't need much at all, like I said. And you know, the calories are pretty much next to none. So as far as flavor goes, this gives you a huge bang for your buck. I'd have to recommend it as well as all of these and these and these. So let me get a screenshot right now. And yeah, that's it. That is my all time favorite sauces and condiments for you guys to make your meal prep that much better for next to no calories, or at least for these five, there's next to no calories. So get on it guys, tastes amazing. I'm gonna have this one with my steak, and I'm gonna have this one with my salad, and uh, I'm cutting at the moment for my show, so if you're interested in that kind of thing, please do subscribe. Plenty more videos to come guys. Until next time, have a great day. Train hard, I'll see you later.